You just flipped the calendar yesterday. Remember how warm it was October, the record warmest in Syracuse? November is not showing signs of that. You're going to have to turn that furnace on as highs fall from yesterday's mid 50s to lower 50s to near 50 today. Even middle 40s as we head towards later this week. Definitely needing that heat and probably into even the weekend, although temperatures are going to be going up. I'm expecting readings to be into the mid 50s and possibly next week into the upper 50s. But definitely brace yourself for the chill already cooling down for today with some wind as well. But besides this cold front, there's another one and behind that is where we've got temperatures in the 20s and you see the snow that's flying up in the upper Great Lakes while we're dealing with mostly rain showers. Now we'll see that evolution as those temperatures go down and we're primarily talking lake effect a little couple sprinkles moving through right now, but we'll work in some sunshine for today tracking one band of lake effect up to Jefferson County and then off of Lake Erie coming in, especially Syracuse South and Southwest that wind flow will become more westerly tonight and tomorrow more northwesterly behind the second front. So here's the future cast by noon close to the 50 degree mark still a little cooler up in Watertown where they're dealing with that lake band and notice how after seeing some sunshine this morning the band off of Lake Erie Lake enhanced shower starts to strengthen a little bit around Onondaga County south and southwest the highest hills maybe some snow or grapple mixing in a better chance for the Tug Hill and the Adirondacks and it strengthens tonight with that westerly wind east of Lake Ontario we're talking accumulating snow I'll show you the map tonight mostly up there north of Onondaga County but there's another front that comes through and that'll drop it southeast of the lake as it breaks up for tomorrow and even cooler weather mid 40s to possibly upper 40s for our highs then as we go into tomorrow night, attention stations, this is Annie at the news. So your future cast snowfall amounts in the light gray, we could get a minor coating Making and a lot remarks. of times that oh. melts. However, when you get over the higher elevations east of I-81 and well north of the thruway, this is one to three inches, three to six inches of snow. That's tonight into tomorrow morning. So your seven day forecast 51 for today, dealing with the scattered rain and snow showers, especially Jefferson County. And then as we get towards midday in this afternoon, Onondaga County south and southwest. Some scattered rain and snow showers, mostly snow at higher elevations, susceptible to some accumulation, especially east of the lake tonight and tomorrow, 47. As we go to Thursday, a few rain and snow showers. We're drying out on Friday. Beautiful weekend in store. Look at that sunshine Saturday, extra hour of sleep. We're back into the 50s. We should be dry for Sunday. Monday, a threat for showers late. Back to you.